Welcome to Bolingbroke Buzz. Today I'm here with Rami Abd of Abs Diner right on the corner of Boughton and Pinecrest. This is a family owned diner that opened up recently. Rami, tell me what you sell here. What kind of food do you have? What we sell here is, fa is mostly like fried food. Uh, we do like cook to order so everything is hot and fresh. Awesome. And uh, we got chicken, we got wings, we got legs and thighs. We catfish. And that catfish and yeah. jumbo shrimp and shrimp basket. We got a huge menu. Is this your first restaurant? That is the first one. It's the restaurant. first one. And when did it open? We opened on the 25th of July. Oh, very yes. recently. Yes, yeah, just this summer. Before you opened the restaurant, did you just cook at home all the time? The whole family was always um, cooking? My brother has been, has been in this business for seven years. Oh, okay. Yeah. So there's five brothers and a sister. Okay. And I got two older, two younger, and the sister. She's like the youngest out of all. Yeah, and then your parents as well. Yep. And you're all involved here at the restaurant. All of us, family business. The older brother, his name is Ezer. He's the one that takes care of everything around here. I'm here with Ezer. Ezer's the head cook here and one of the older brothers uh, in the family. So, Ezer, what are you cooking right now? Uh, triple cheeseburger I have. And I have a uh, Philly steak already, a uh, gyro plate, gyro sandwich, so... Everything at once, huh? Yes. I love catfish. Do you want to try it from my hand? Oh, try cooking it? Yes. Oh, let's do it. All right, come here. <laughs> All right, put it here for the flour. Make sure it's covered for the flour. It's not right. All right. Now, I'm going to show you. Okay. Oh, that's how you do it. Yes. Make sure it has a lot of flour Fully and then covered. cover and that's it. Okay. Okay. That's it? Did that's you it. Fry it? Yes. What? Yeah. And from here. This for the fish. This one just for fish. How long does this take? Around like seven minutes, eight okay. minutes. We have a one sandwich that is called the gym shoe. A gym shoe? A gym shoe. Oh goodness. It's about it's about a foot long and it's fried, <laughs> it's crispy, it's so nice. What is it? What kind of meat is it? Gyro, like the gyro. How long does it cook on here? It depends, you know. I just open this two sides, stick about like five, seven minutes. With the onions and then the green pepper grow together. And then we put the corn beef. We put Italian beef. Wow. Then we wrap them in tortilla bread. And we fry them. Wow. So the, that does sound pretty Yeah, the, the sandwich comes out about a foot long. Oh, that's it's enough awesome. to feed three people. The gym shoe. Yeah, shoe. <laughs> How did you come up with that name? Honestly, it's been the thing in Chicago. Oh, really? Yeah, awesome. yeah. That looks good. And then the fish. And then the fish. They finished it for me. I got distracted looking at all this good food. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. What made you as a family decide to open a restaurant and what made you pick this location here in Bolingbroke? Honestly, we've been in this area for a while. My uncle is the next door. When we come to visit my uncle, there's not too much things here to eat. Yeah. So we had the business laid down. We just had our time like, you know, we thought about, you know, surging around. We came here. Then we saw this place ready for a business, so we took it. I'm here with more of the Ab family. They're here enjoying dinner right now. Tell me, what are your favorite meals? What's your favorite meal? Uh, double cheeseburger. Double cheeseburger? Um, fries. Fries, that's your favorite? <laughs> so with the Philly, you know, we got three. We got the chicken, we got the steak, and we got the mix. So the process is pretty easy. So what we do here is that we, uh, we grill the onions and then the green pepper first. Then once it's like half we cooked, we'll put on the meat, then grill them all together. Then we put them in the bread. Now the crispy chicken. Uh, so we get the chicken fresh and we cut it for ourselves. Then we, uh, what we do is that we, we get it and we put it in the flour, then throw it in the fire for like tw uh, for, for 10 minutes. Then we take it out. Put it on the grill for a couple minutes, then put the cheese on it, let it like malt on it, wow. and then pack it on from there. Thank you. 
the ones I like the most is seeing people coming back, you know, coming back, telling me good things about the food. Sure. For a while, I didn't know anything about the Facebook po pictures yeah. and how like people well, were let reacting. Me tell you, Facebook has been. It's been a buzz. Yep, that about, was that was a surprise to me. That yeah. was a surprise to me. I a few customer walked in. It was like, hey, you guys are like blowing on Facebook, and I'm like, wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then they showed me, and I was like so happy, you know. If people want to learn more about your menu or get in contact with you, what do you guys have social media? Do you have a website? How do people find you? Yeah, we have uh, Facebook, Abs Diner, uh, Instagram, Abs Diner. We also have the website, Abs Diner. You can go there, you can check out the menu, see people review, and you can even order from there online or call us because our food is always served hot and fresh. So it usually takes about 10 to 15 minutes to make that. So. It'll be better if you mind the wait, you can just always call or replace the order online. And that makes it easy for you, you can just come and pick it up. Alright, you guys the Philly steak? Oh. Woo! Ooh, I, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. This is so good. Sorry Liz, this is mine. Okay. <laughs> it's really hot actually. <laughs>